Hi everybody. Okay, I have been working for days on a video, not this one, but um, I recorded it, re-recorded it, uploaded it, recorded it again, re-re-recorded it again, and I think this next time is going to be the right one. But I had to stop and do this video first. I don't think I've ever done a video like this before, but I had to do it because um, I just finished watching the movie Wednesday. And okay, I don't know about you, but when I watch movies, I watch the things that, that catch my attention are the clothing. Obviously, I'm a seamstress. That's what I look at all the time. That's why I'm always, it's I, subconscious. That's just what I see. And so I was watching this movie and the little girl who, um, Wednesday Adams is the daughter of Morticia and Gomez. And she arrives at the school and they chose the perfect person for this this part. Her name is Jenna Ortega and I think she's got the perfect look for this part. And it actually brings back some fond memories of my own teenage daughter when she used to give me the same death looks. I mean, I think I dealt with it for like three years and it's now it's a fond memory. Back then, not so much, but all is good. She loves me, I love her, we're very close, and it's just teenage stuff you have to deal with for a little while. Don't worry, they grow out of it. So what I, I had to make this video because we I had made a video for my channel before about collars, and oh my gosh, there's so many good collars in this movie. So the first one is of Wednesday, and it's the long tip collar, and it's so funny because I have been thinking about designing an outfit with that collar for myself. But I do a lot of thinking. I don't do a lot of sewing for myself, even though I have tons of ideas. It's just that, you know, fabric's expensive and oh my gosh. And I have so many other things I'm working on, but I really want to like put my ideas into action eventually. And hopefully I'll, I can do this on the channel. So, and now I don't know if it's, just the collar itself, which I think is interesting. But when I think about it, I always think about a scene that goes with it. So when I was watching Wednesday, it has this, you have the dark goth like background and the whole vibe and the mood and the, the jacket that goes with it. And they did a really, really good job on these, on these outfits. Um, and you know we don't walk around day to day in this type of like atmosphere though and i think it really resonated with me because when i was a teenager i was a goth girl so that's still very much in me i like that i like the dark academia look um but i'm kind of like in a in a situation where i'm going i love this is it appropriate for a 54 year old and and if not, how can I make it where it's appropriate? Because I don't want to look like I'm trying to be younger than I am. I have no problem being 54 years old. Um, I look in the mirror, I'm going, oh, dang, you're 54. And because when I'm not looking in the mirror, I feel like I'm in my 20s. So I have to constantly be thinking about, is this age appropriate? Does it look like I'm trying to be younger? And then who cares? Just do whatever you want. And so I have this like conflict going inside of me. So that aside, I'm wondering if, if I did a collar with that, those long points or whatever, will it translate well to like everyday life? And should I even care? I don't know. So anyway, I have my notes. Um, so on the, and there's another character, um, Bianca Barkley, who's played by Joy Sunday. I can't really tell. I, I looked up online to find out like what collar is this? Is it a club collar? It looks like a kind of a blend between maybe a club collar and an extreme cutaway. But the extreme cutaways have kind of a point out here and the club doesn't. So that in the pictures online, the club just kind of comes down a little bit. So it's, it's spread way out and high like a cutaway, but they don't have the points on it. So you guys look at the pictures that I'm gonna put up and let me know what you think. Is it extreme cutaway? Is it a club collar? And then you don't see much from Lurch, but there is 
a point where you see him and he's got the little wingtip collars. I just, this movie just gave me all the feels. I, the costumes were really good. So we have the wingtips and I have another picture of Eugene and Wednesday and they both look like they have that collar again Although this one looks more spread out than Bianca's did. So um, I'm not sure. The angle's different, so I can't really tell which is which. Okay. Now, my favorite collar is this one. It's the lace long point. It's got a, a high stand, collar stand, and then it comes down to the points. This one was beautiful. They also showed her cuffs. And it was, it was beautiful. And I'm not a lace person, but this is beautiful. Now, when I zoomed in on the picture, um, it looks like it's crocheted, which is beautiful still, but it didn't look crisp. And I think if I could find something like this or do something like this, that it's a real crisp, sharp collar, that would be amazing. But um, yeah, you guys leave a comment in the comment box and let me know what you think what these collars are called according to the pictures I'm, I'm putting up for you to see. Also, when I watch movies or shows, my mind is always on the clothing. I mean, not even, not even consciously, but subconsciously. And sometimes I'll see something and it just like kind of takes my breath away a little bit. It's just like, wow. And again, is it just that garment or is it the garment with the scene that's around it you know what are your guys's experience am i the oddball or am i kind of like one of the million that also feel that way and look at movies that way i remember my daughters we would watch something and i'm looking at clothing i'm looking at scenery i'm like what how is this set up and you know what does the clothing look like and the details and my daughters will come with me later mom do you remember watching this and i'm like no mom oh my gosh we watched it like five times together and i have to remind them i don't watch for storyline and plot my mind just goes to clothing i don't know i can't help it so probably i would remember if they point out clothing now aside from the collars um i love the i love wednesday's outfits the jacket you look at the jacket and you go oh that's that's basic. It's just a jacket. And then you have like the pinstripe with a gradient line going, you know, across it and it uh, across it, across it. And it looks, it looks cool. I, I think it's interesting. I, I used to want to be a designer and I kind of still want to, but I don't have unique ideas. You know, I think of something and it just goes to the basic whatever. So I feel like if I worked on my, on my design all the time, you know, more often, try this, try that, do this, do that. I think I could break out of that. I just have to do it. So, um, do you guys, what do you guys think? Did you guys see the movie? What did you think about it? Um, what else, if you did watch it, what else in the movie stood out to you? You know, was it clothing? Was it set up? Um, have you ever looked at a movie saw the clothing and been inspired by it leave a comment in the in the comment box below if you like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and if you'd like to support the channel hit the thank you button and you can give a monetary gift and that'll just help in being able to produce more videos thanks guys bye